All right, first things first, this video is operating under the assumption that you already have a Google Analytics account. Uh, if you don't, go ahead and sign up for that first. It's completely free, and all you need to have is a Gmail or a Google account, which, frankly, if you don't have a Google account uh, in 2018, um, I don't know what you're doing. So, yeah, get a Google account, sign up for Google Al Analytics, and uh, I'll show you how to install Google Analytics into your Weebly website. Okay, so to set up Google Analytics in your Weebly website, uh, log into Google Analytics and you'll see this, the analytics dashboard. And we'll navigate down to the admin at the bottom left here. Click that. Um, you already have an account set up, so you have just the one account with your name there. And then under, what you need to do is create a property. So under the property menu, we're going to click create new property because you won't have one set up yet. Um, then I'll ask you what would you like to track. You're going to click website and enter the name of your website. Uh, high Peak Snowboards, we'll use as an example. And the website URL, so let's say it's highpeaksnowboards.com. Now this is important here. Uh, you have to select HTTP or HTTPS. Now every, uh, you know, since I think October or November, Google is starting to punish websites that don't have HTTPS, uh, which is basically an, an SSL certificate that adds extra security to your website. Weebly offers this completely for free uh, for all Weebly paid Weebly users. So um, I have a video on how to uh, install that as well. You can check that out later, but you definitely need to have the SSL certificate if you want to uh, boost your SEO ranking. So we'll click HTTPS, put our domain there, our category, uh, let's say sports, Reporting time zone, let's say we're on the Pacific Coast, Pacific time zone in the United States. Then click Get Tracking ID. And it'll generate a Google Analytics tag code that we would install into the Weebly website. So this is the code that we're going to copy and paste into our Weebly website. So you've now set up a um, property, Google Analytics property and you now have your custom tracking ID and now we're going to now I'm going to show you how to install this code into your Weebly website. So now we're going to copy this custom code and we're going to put it into our Weebly website. So we'll navigate back to Weebly and we'll go to settings and then under SEO on the left hand side we'll click that and then right here where it says footer code and it shows right here, example, Google Analytics tracking code. So right here in the footer code, we're going to go ahead and paste that. And that's it. You've now, and then, well, obviously you gotta click save too. Um, and then click publish. And so now you have the tracking code installed into your Weebly website. And now we wanna confirm that it's working properly. So let's do that. So to confirm that uh, you installed it correctly, uh, go back to your Google Analytics dashboard and on the left hand side you'll see an option called real time. And click that. And what this does is it actually shows you the exact amount of people that are on your website right now. It's got live real time tracking. So now that you have this window open, you'd want to go back to your published website, and visit it yourself on another tab and your number your like should pop up here right now it's a zero because no one's visiting the website obviously it's just an example website um, but if, if you're visiting your published website uh, it should say one right here and it should show you as an active user so that's the quickest way to confirm that your google analytics is working and uh, if you see that then you've installed it correctly and if you don't see it and you're having some issues feel free to uh, hit me up email me or Twitter or whatever, and uh, I can help you out. Thanks for watching.